Hi, I'm Melissa Atkins, one of the instructional technologists with Lamar County School District. Um, what I want to discuss with you today is something that's been driving a lot of people crazy. Um, for those of you that use Open Office as your Word document or processing program, um, there's something important that you need to make sure to do before you send it to someone, um, whether it be email or on a flash drive or through Google Drive, you need to make sure to change it to the DOC format, save it as a DOC, rather than the standard Open Office um, extension, which is ODT. Because if people don't have Open Office on their computer and you send it as an ODT, they are not able to open it up. And it gets quite frustrating. So I'm going to show you how to um, save in Open Office to where it's a DOC. All right, uh, for this tutorial, I am using a document that I created in Open Office and mistakenly just saved it as ODT, shared it with someone, and they couldn't open it because they didn't have Open Office on their computer. So now I have to go back, and this is what you'll have to do for those documents you've already created. You will need to go back and save them as DOCs, and I'm going to show you how. By the way, this is a blog entry that I hope you read. You can access it at bit.ly.com slash techieparentsoapbox. I hope it makes you think as much as it made me think. Anyway, let's resave this. So you would go up to File and go to Save As. In the box that appears, and if it appears like this, you still have your file type, that's fine. Right now it's an ODF text document, an ODT, and we do not need that anymore. So we change it, you click on the little arrows, and then you find this format, the Microsoft Word 97 slash 2000 slash XP DOC. That's the one you choose. Then you click Save. This is very common that you see in OpenOffice. Ignore this Save in ODF format. We don't want to use OpenOffice anymore um, because we now have Microsoft Office. But if you are insisting on using Open Office, you will ignore this save in ODF format and you would keep the current format. So now, if I wanted to attach this file to an email or upload it into Google Drive or send it to someone in any other way, they would be able to open it because it's now saved as a DOC. Now, to keep you from having to do that for everything you create from here on out, there is an easy way to format open office to where it automatically where it defaults to save in the DOC format. That's what I'm going to show you now. On the Mac you would go to open office org in the menu at the top and then go to preferences. On a PC you would go to tools in the menu bar at the top and then go to options and this same box will show up. Now I am in the load save option on the left. You would click on the little triangle and then click on general. Towards the bottom, you should see where it says document type. Right now it's at text document. If yours isn't, you can change it. And it says ODF text document. What you want to do and what you need to do is change this to the Microsoft Word 97 2000 XP version. While you're at it, go ahead and go back and change spreadsheets for any spreadsheets you may have created in Open Office and change that to the Excel version. Not the template, but the Microsoft Excel 97 2000 XP choice. One more that you need to do is presentations, like your slideshows. Instead of having them default and save as ODF presentation, you want to change that one as well to the Microsoft PowerPoint version. The 97 2000 XP, not the template, just the one that says the XP. And then you would click OK. I believe on a PC you would have to click Save. But then you don't have to worry about it anymore. Any document file that you create in Open Office will automatically now save as a DOC or an Excel or a P, um, PowerPoint extension to where when you share it with someone, they'll be able to open it. I hope this helps. Thank you.